Warhammer Commanders Above Planet Servers. Welcome to Daemon X Machia. This is a mech character customization robot game. So let's see how it goes. I believe we pilot a mech and customize our own character. And then we go on solo campaign. I'm playing solo campaign, but I believe there's online to this. And right now, are we watching our planet get destroyed? I actually started this cutscene on accident, but you know, let's just jump right in. It's kind of nice. Ooh. Um, hmm. So is this like a space station? Okay. Oh, a piece of it's falling down. And what planet? Who knows? Oh, that's a big explosion. Okay, that's not good. We're just gonna sit there and watch? So what, they destroyed the moon and then part of the moon hit the earth? Or is that could be a different planet? Could be. And here we go. What's going on here? Oh, graphics are a little different than I was expecting. I guess they kind of got that, I don't want to say anime type graphics when they do games, but kind of does. I don't know. And this is currently free on the Epic Game Store right now, so get it while you can. It is free until Thursday, which is whatever day it is. I didn't check beforehand, so I posted somewhere up there. Alright, so we got a character customization. Alright, so what do we press enter to change? Male or female? It won't be male. So we got skin color. What do we got here? It kind of looks like old man. Uh, the first one isn't that bad. Let's go with that one. I want hair style. I honestly think like, the first one's probably the best. I know I'm so boring. No, not the first one. I'm saying this one. So now let's go to color. Because oh, the browns never look like brown in games. It's so hard to get good brown. They always look like almost like blackish. Like, let's go with that brown. Ah, oh, that's fine. Sure. I uh, really hope we can make our eyebrows match. No. <laughs> A face. What do we got here? Okay, so let's think about this. That one's not bad. I think I like this one more. Yeah, let's go with that one. Sure. What does it mean my skin? Or we get away with the wrinkles? Can we just make this normal? Like, no wrinkles whatsoever? Just get rid of everything? Yeah, there we go. Smooth skin. Eyebrows. We gotta change color. The shape. You know what? Those are fine. Sure. I'm not gonna take too much time. Position can go a little higher, I guess. And I said height just a tad higher and gap a little closer. Alright. And color wise, we got match your hair. What you just like hair color, but you can't. Looks a little bright. Go a little darker on hair. No, it's a skill, but that's fine. Facial hair, there we go. Come up that baby skin smooth. No. Oh, beard's kind of still looked great, so. Oh, that's always disappointing. But full beard it is. Oh, I don't like how that looks, but you know, we'll there. And the color. Oh, uh, it. It's like, won't well, quite right, match. That one matches close enough. My eyes. I just want blue. No, eye shape. I want that bright. Can I go lighter? You know, it is too dark blue. I'm not even trying to mess with it. You know, I don't like that. No, I want my eyes to be the same. Scar tattoo. Don't want any. Cosmetic wise. I don't want eyeshadow, I think. Volleys. There we go. What do we got here? We're gonna press up. Uh, it's whatever. In my suit, we got outer prototype, or we have to go with that one. That one just looks cool. Does that show a scar me right now? I gotta get rid of that. And color wise, and color, right. so I mean, that's good enough. I don't want to be on forever. I already have them. Confirm name, Flim, Flim. That work? Name you enter will also be multiplier. Okay. And here we are. Okay. Please say music is not copyright. It seems like the my last couple of videos all the music has been copyright. Been a nightmare. And he looks alright. Like I said, I wish I would adjust his eye color to be not as dark or bright. Cause dark would be fine, but it's just too bright. Alright, now where are Link we going? Accepted. Oh. Okay. Greetings. My name is Four. Hi Four. I am the operator who serves as the liaison between orbital and outers like yourself. Okay. No you have just recovered from transplant surgery to install your neural link terminal. Oh. At this time, your biometric data in the oval link will be updated and registered with Orbital. Okay. This is your arsenal on loan from Orbital. Ooh. Before we register you as a mercenary, you must complete an aptitude test. Accept the mission from this terminal and await dispatch. Okay. Let me do it. Mission, Hangar, and System. Let's go missions. 
And what's our first mission gonna be? Accepting missions. Accepting an offer mission will advance the main story. Select a mission. All right. Offer mission. That's the main story. And rank E is aptitude. So sure. All Russian mercenaries of Orbital and Consortiums must submit to Epu test to determine outer fitness. So we eliminate the MAI, sure. And I guess we'll just start. I got a thousand credits. Here we go. Ooh, welcome to your battlefield. Initiating arsenal boot sequence. Data link, normal. Generator pool, normal. Energy limiter released. Feels like we're going to some Kazoo's now. Magnetic armor operating at normal levels. Boom specific rim. Open safety mechanism released. All systems normal. Commencing launch. Here we go. The outer aptitude test will begin soon. This is a live fire exercise, but you have nothing to worry about. Oh, so it'd be just boring? Hardly anyone fails this test. Oh. Two veteran mercenaries will serve as observers during the test. Tutorial. This is Reaper of the Western Seven. I'll be joining you as an observer. And I'm Queen of Panzer Crown. Charmed, I'm sure. Is that the two groups we can choose from? Observers for the aptitude test are selected at random from a pool of qualified mercenaries. They're here to make sure the test is conducted fairly, and to intervene if your life is threatened. Oh, okay. What Four said, if things get dicey, just ask us for help. That said, don't expect to pass if you nearly die out here. Okay, that makes sense. For Oval, and the world as a whole, hours like yourself are among our most valuable resources. However, if the cost of your arsenal repairs consistently exceeds the profit you generate, your value may be reassessed. Makes sense. We get it. Let's get this over with already. Like Four said, hardly anyone fails this test. If you're not sure what to do, prioritize your survival. Just trust your instincts and you'll pass with flying colors. We will now begin the aptitude test. Please direct your attention to your radar. Oh. The aptitude test will begin once you cross the blue boundary. Move out and the proceed sun. to the designated right. coordinates as instructed. What on our HUD here? Oh. Radar display legend. So enemies are in red, missions are in orange. That's all I need now. Ammo. Okay. Tank. Okay. WASD. Move camera jump and okay. Activate flight mode and deactivate control. Boost the shift. That's what I just did there. Cool. Attack at enemies. Aim and then press right click to use weapon equipment. Right arm or left click for left. Okay. And you'll lock on enemies when they're into your size from the blue cursor means you lock down a target. Red cursor increase your primary attack target. Q and E for shoulder and auxiliary. C displays the right arm weapon swap mate. Oh geez, there's a lot too. That's uh, we'll learn as we go. The designated coordinates. The aptitude test will now begin. The next right. phase will begin shortly. Let's shoot them all up. Oh my other one's a shield, okay. The vital points gauge will deplete as you receive damage from enemies. Uh -huh. This gauge represents your arsenal's durability. Should it fall to zero, the test will Move. end. To log uh -huh. on to an enemy, align the site in the center of your monitor over the target. Recovery tanks destroy VP recovery tanks will generate recovery area under their area to gradually recover VP, which is against my Once locked on, you may fire. Your Damn. arsenal OS will correct for any minor lapses in firearm accuracy. Ooh, I'm flying. To avoid enemy fire. Hmm. And to get in range there? to return fire. Oh, there you are. Come on. Ooh, okay. I can't get the fly there. It's a verticality. Am I getting shot at? Oh, behind me. No way for me. I guess I should be shielding myself. Oh, what's happening? Oh, the tanks are coming in. The tanks go march you one by one. No. Alright. Maybe rolling. Designated enemy AIs have been detected by your radar. Alright. I will, I will. Alright. Where's other ones? Where they at? Alright. I guess safely down here. So there's an orange one this way. So let's head on this way. And go up. Looks like they're up here. Alright. It's a lot, a lot on my HUD that I think I'm not using that much. Alright, I gotta go down, go down. Alright. There we go, I gotta get use controls. I'm, I'm not usually, um, a person uses control much, to be honest. I like using my mouse keys for that. And like seasons, I don't know, I just don't do well with that. Alright, and they're all this way now. I feel like I'm pretty floaty. Oh, they're way out there. I wonder how far I can shoot. Alright. 
So fail to achieve past the score. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll be fine. Let's fly. Oh, I missed that crazy. I guess we sh should not go over that hill. Are we be hitting him? Oh, there's the damage in here. Oh, that's not so easy to hit, actually. From far range with this weapon. So in the uh, loading screen, showed I can change equipment, and it's based on, like, weight. So, it's one of those games, like most mech games, you have a weight when you customize your character. Like the Altec and such. Alright. I should be fine. That's good. You are hereby recognized by Orbital and the Consortiums as a registered mercenary. Cool. From now on, you will help us work toward world peace by completing assigned missions. Alright. Thank you for your service. I'm gonna try to learn how to fly right now. And now what do I do? Oh, just on my hands. Okay, good. Let's go fly with me. Alright. So let's just hold a skip, because yeah, it's giving me time too. And there you have it. That wasn't too bad. So I got no spins up, I didn't really get hurt that much. I get a new weapon, a Grim Reaper AT, ooh, and a Fudgeman Pilot to defeat the first enemy arsenal. Man, here we are. So what's all this stuff about? That's online, we'll try with others. Ooh, cool. What's this one? This one, exploration missions. Working with other players, you will explore the inner workings of a labyrinth facility. Reach our souls and death of facility and defeat them to complete the missions. Exploration missions can vary in difficulty. And then you get rewards. Okay, so that's like the PvE content with other people. I like that. And I guess I can look at my arsenal. Viewing your play record, you can view your total play record and claim your game progress. So I got 15 minutes. So that was a tutorial, which wasn't bad at all. So we access here now. We have a console, so a hanger maybe. Equip install equipment. Alright, here we go. In the hanger, you can change armor or weapons, a pair or so equip weapons, okay? And weapons. My right weapon, I got all. Okay, so this one's vector range. So it has more capacity. No. So that's my right one. My left one, all. I can do this. So, oh, it just says description out there. So, assault rifle holds enough ammo to be used in various situations. Or a Reaper and assault rifle for new recruits, low spec, but equipped with automated fire mechanism. Automated. That sounds cool. I don't want this anymore, I don't want this. Okay, so my shoulder weapon, then I have nothing for it. I I have nothing. Pylon, I can put this on it, correct? My right pylon, my left one, I have nothing else. Okay, I see how it is. And now I can go to um, armor. My head, I only have one. Body, I have one. So it looks like I have one of everything, okay. Now we go paint though. Arsenal paint customize your arsenal appearance however you like. Alright. So, I want patterns. Oh, we can just change it out. Like, I don't see a difference, so I don't have none. No. Alright, so let's go with color. Full body. So, color one. So, white. Color two. That's, that's that part, so let's go lighter. So, like there. My like color three to the dark. Sure. And you, that's just for full body. You can do like the head separate. So, what's this? That's the tips. Like that would be that. In car one. Oh, that's the whole thing. Okay. I don't need to go that detail. Sure, save it. Yeah, decals. I don't know where that goes. But yeah, I don't want decals for now. That's cool. Unless you can probably import for your own way. So, you can load out and you can test it around. Okay. And then system is probably how we save. Profile, save, load, play log. Okay, cool. I think I'm going to end it here. So, get this game by February 3rd, 2022 on the Epic Games Store. Why it's free to keep. Links in the description if you want it for yourself. And comment down in the comment section if you want more of this game. So, like always, thanks for watching. Have a great day. And, bye.